keratosis pilaris and tattoos. Carefully weigh the pros and cons of getting tattoos if you suffer from keratosis pilaris. Tattoos may be okay if your tattoo was placed in an area of your body not affected by KP. However, there is always the risk of provoking an allergic reaction, which can worsen KP symptoms. Is it wise to put tattoos over KP? People with sensitive skin risk getting infections or allergic reactions such as redness, itching, and soreness. Sensitive skin combined with a condition like KP creates an even greater risk. The chances of an allergic reaction or infection are also increased if your KP symptoms are severe. Getting a tattoo placed directly over a severely affected area may both worsen symptoms and detract from the beauty of your body art. When in doubt, consult your dermatologist. Deciding to go forward with your tattoo. If you decide to get a tattoo, start with a small one first to see how your skin reacts. If your KP symptoms increase, think about postponing additional tattoos for a while. KP symptoms typically subside as you grow older. By waiting until your symptoms diminish before getting a tattoo, you lower the risk of having a bad reaction. Keratosis pilaris tattoo removal. Removing a tattoo is much more difficult than getting one. Laser removal is perhaps the most common removal method. But while modern lasers can help reduce pain and minimize scarring, the process can be time-consuming and expensive. Most laser tattoo removal treatments require several sessions that depend on multiple factors. These include age, size, skin coloring, skin condition, and the type of tattoo a person has. Removing a KP tattoo could be problematic resulting in an adverse skin reaction. Decide carefully. Before getting a tattoo, consider your decision carefully to avoid bad skin reactions and removal complications. While the idea of getting a tattoo with KP shouldn't be dismissed out of hand, it's best to be cautious.